course, like the beginning of a 5K, 10K, or a marathon, or a half marathon for, for somebody. You've got a lot of adrenaline, and you're ready to go. As soon as they, you know, they count down, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then you go, and pew! Hold on, make sure, hopefully you don't fall off the back of this land. That would be bad. <laughs> It's just exciting to see the energy that the dogs um, have for, for running. That's what they're bred to do. They love it. They, they know it's race day, you know. Like, all right. The Devereaux family from, from East Wenatchee. This would be a good excuse to go see something that we hadn't seen before. So here's coming one around the corner. My name is uh, Dom Gordon. I got into dog sledding probably by accident. I got a couple of dogs. I wanted some, a running partner, and so I got Siberian Huskies. I was in the military at the time and I got stationed in uh, Fort Leavenworth, Kansas and I knew it was going to snow so I bought a small sled, hooked up the two Siberians and after that I was hooked. It's just really quiet. yeah, quiet and peaceful <laughs> when you're just cruising down the trail and you just kind of, you know, taking in, taking in the wilderness and listening to the dogs, you know. The, the only sound is like the runners and the little jingle. Uh, the snaps on the collars. When you're running a dog sled team, unlike a horse, there's no way to direct that team. It's all verbal commands. So those dogs have to understand what you, what your expectations are based on what you tell them. You have to have a really close bond with the animals, and that's just something that, that just happens. You know, at the finishers' banquet, and they're like, "Oh, I don't know why I do this sport," but then you know, next She's next year you. they'll be there again. You know, oh yeah. And then at the finish line again, they'll be like, "I don't know what I'm doing here." Well, that's what I'll do next time. <laughs> it was a great race. Uh, it was great to see folks out there. Uh, I just enjoyed it the whole time, and uh, I'll be back next year to do it again.